Hey guys, Josh here. I'm here with Coach Katie. We're going to go over this week's density set workout. So we're going to have six stations this week. We're going to be going for 80 seconds per station, 20 seconds to rotate. We'll have a couple exercises per station. We're going to go around the room twice with a break in between, and then we'll have a quick finisher at the end. So station number one on the rows, we're doing some in-out slams. So Katie's feet are outside, her hands are inside. She's going to bring those feet together, take those rows outside. Feet apart, slam inside, feet together, slam outside. Inside, outside. Inside, outside, you can do five of each or ten total. You're going to turn around, you're going to go if you know it's right, if you need to, you can just step side to side here if you can take some of that impact out. Our second exercise over here on the sliders, you can get those feet on the sliders, and you have an option here, you can army crawl. So, feet on those sliders, reaching with those elbows, squeezing those glutes nice and tight, blowing up those abs, getting a lot of anti-extension extension work here and then you can either push yourself backwards or turn around and army crawl back your second option is to slide or crawl down and back here you'll put your hands on the sliders keep those knees off the floor drive with those legs down and back you could also just bear crawl without the sliders or if this is hard on your shoulders you could do prisoner lunges down and back, hands behind the head, squeeze those shoulder blades, take that deep breath in on the way down, and just lunge to halfway down the floor, and then lunge halfway back. That's station number one. Station number two, we're coming over to the wall, we're gonna do some wall ball slams. So, you're gonna grab one of our slam balls right here at the wall, keeping that ball right under your chin here, right at your chest, you're gonna sit low, come on up, and slam that ball against the wall. Think of this as one motion here. As you come up, you're slamming that ball, you're gonna get five hard slams. So remember, they're hard slams, so it's not five fast, slams it's one hard slam done five times in a row our second exercise you're gonna grab the suspension trainers here and we're gonna do our bicep curl so we're in that plank position legs straight glute squeeze walk those abs ribs tucked Katie's elbows are up high she's squeezing those biceps pulling those hands right toward her face and then over her shoulders keeping those elbows up here really working those guns if you want you can give a little kiss as you pull them up show them what it looks like okay yeah, a little kiss. You gotta show those biceps some love here. Squeeze those glutes tight. Remember, to make it heavier, you step further in. To make it lighter, you just step a little further out. From there, we're coming over to the blue floor. And the hardest thing you're gonna do all day, folks, is get this band around those ankles in that 20 seconds. Pull that band apart, step on in. Then you're gonna get a band low around those shins. And we're actually gonna do some monster walks here. So nice wide stance. And now Kiki's gonna take that step forward. One, two, two steps back one two one two now if you can't count to two just do one 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 okay chest up big wide steps then you're gonna do that five times on each leg ten total and then you're gonna go down to our push-up position pushing the ground or push-up plank position push the ground away from me here and you're gonna do those plank abductions so Katie raises that leg and then reaches with it she's gonna switch sides going back and forth here raising that leg and taking it out to the side. If you need to, you can always come down to your knees and take a break for a second and come back up. But you're gonna do five each side here, so 10 total. Then you're coming back up and you're going right back into those monster walks here. This station's really gonna work those glutes today, guys. And then from there, we're coming over to our kettlebells and we're gonna be doing some deadlifts here. So you're gonna pull that kettlebell out, arch that lower back, chest up, Squeeze those glutes as you drive on up and pull those shoulders back at the top. Notice how KK starts by pushing her butt back, hinging with those hips, and then taking that kettlebell straight up and down here, driving those hips forward at the top. You're gonna do five heavy deadlifts, then you're gonna come over, we'll have a box set up for you, we're gonna do some box walkovers. So, starting in that plank position, one hand on the box, you're gonna come up and then switch hands. Now, the wider you go here, the more challenging it's gonna be. You're gonna go five to each side. If you wanna challenge yourself here, you'll add that push up in. So deep breath in, push that air out here, squeezing that shoulder blade, really focusing on the work being done by the arm on the box, not the arm on the floor here. You'll do five in each direction, then you're back to those five deadlifts. So this is a really challenging station as well, everybody. From there, we're coming over to our throwers and skiers. So, another fun cardio station over here. Over here, we're gonna do on the skiers, you're gonna do 10 strokes on that skier, get those soft bend in those elbows, pulling those hands straight back. Notice how KK's coming up to her toes, and then sitting that butt back to really pull those handles down as fast and as hard as she can. 10 strokes, then you're gonna hop on your rower, this one over here, and then you're gonna get your feet set up here, and we're gonna go 100 meters on that rower. 
So as you start to drive through, deep breath in. You also have KK's trying to keep her back straight. I want you to avoid reaching and rounding with your upper back. So show me what it looks like when we reach and round. I want you to avoid reaching here. Stay straight up just like we practiced with that deadlift. You're gonna do a lot less damage to that lower back. So on here, you're gonna get 100 meters. Check and reading the meters on the, uh, on the screen here. And after 100 meters, you're popping back out and you're back over to ski or just back and forth on those two, state, uh, two exercises. Then the last station over on the dumbbells, we're gonna be doing our Arnold presses. So two dumbbells, palms turn in facing you. Think of this as four steps. You're gonna open up by squeezing those shoulder blades. Press high overhead, reaching for the ceiling. Pull them back down, and then bring those hands back together. So we open up by squeezing those shoulder blades. Press overhead, pull them back down like you're doing a pull up, and then bringing those hands back in. You're gonna do five of those, and then you're gonna go into reverse lunges here. So if you want, you can go with a different weight on those dumbbells. You can hold those dumbbells at your sides here. You can also hold them at your chest if you'd like. And we're going to do five lunges on each leg. Chest up, take that step back, squeezing that back glute tight. And then think about keeping your weight on that front leg here as you drive on up. Think about crushing a soda can with your heel as you step up. Five on each leg, and then you're back to those Arnold presses. So that's our density set workout for this week. Great job, KK. Thank you.